the morning. Sun ain't even out yet. But we finna ready to go on this adventure. I can't wait. Actually, I actually uh, fucked up. And I ordered tickets to the wrong airport. I know. I know. How do you order tickets to the wrong airport? I have no idea. But it's like a 40 minute drive from Miami. So it's not too bad. But what's really fucked up is I was trying to get a sports car right. Because, you know, the reason I'm going to Miami is for my birthday. And this new airport I'm going to, I'm flying into Fort Lauderdale instead of Miami, don't have sports cars. At least, I don't think so. I'm going to have to see, but they wouldn't let me reserve one. So, we're going to see. But uh, I'm going to head to the airport now. Just got in like a like an hour and a half ago. We got a rental car. I'm glad to be out that plane. As you see, I got that stain. I got that thing. I had to get some good. I really did not want like a Toyota Corolla or no damn Hyundai or no shit. I really wanted a sports car. That was the main reason I was pissed off that I actually reserved it for Fort Lauderdale. Like, how do, I still can't believe I did that shit, but I got my car. So far, I'm not used to these trees. It seems like a fucking, uh, like surreal. Like it's the type of shit you see on TV, but in person, you just never imagine it. But uh, I'm probably finna start off going to a beach because it's Miami Beach, might as well and then get some food because I'm starving. I've been dieting hard as hell to get in shape so I can come here. I did not want to come here fat at all. Left two lanes. Alright, so the first place we end up going was South Point Pier. So far, this should actually be pretty nice. After this, I'm probably going to head to Key Biscayne and then get some food. What up, you guys? So, it's the next day. Um, I didn't record the end of yesterday because the camera died. I didn't do that much. I just pretty much took a nap and ate some food. Today is my birthday. Yup, I'm turning 26. So, today I got a few things planned. The first thing that um, I'm trying to do is uh, go paddling. So, uh, no, kayaking? Canoe? I think it's called kayaking. Canoeing, I think, is something else. But I'm finna go kayaking and uh, we're gonna go to an island actually off the coast. So that's gonna be interesting. Now, I don't know how long it's gonna take, but hopefully, I can get some footage of that. Alright, I'll see y'all there. What up, you guys? All right, so as y'all can see, I'm back at the crib. So it's safe to say that uh, things ain't go like I thought it was gonna go. So first of all, it wasn't kayaking. We actually end up going paddle boating. 
and I was gonna record, but I left my um I was gonna record, but I left my camera inside the rental car because we was this close to missing it because we couldn't find a parking spot. Miami has no fucking parking. All right, and then on top of that, I'm kind of glad that I left it in the car because so the paddle boats, right? Everyone else's paddle boats was perfectly fine, but the one we got in, I don't know if it's because we were heavy, if it was a weight limit or, or whatever, but we were sitting lower than everybody else. So when we got into it, it was like this much water left before the boat literally sank. So we paddled to the island pretty easily. Like, there was no trouble there. But coming back, it just so happens there are people with jet skis and they're flying up and down where we were going. So they're creating waves and those waves were knocking our paddle boat side to side to the point where we start getting water to come on and we almost sunk. I'm so glad I didn't bring my camera because I think my camera would have been drenched in water because that's how much water went on the paddle boat. On my birthday, a real nigga almost drowned. And <laughs> to make it even worse, after that, I try to salvage the day. I'm like, all right, let's go to this market. It's this place called Bayside Market. And they got a bunch of vendors and a bunch of food, you know. I was on a diet. I wanted to try a bunch of food. So I was like, let's do it. Uh, I came there to eat. I wanted to try some authentic Peruvian food, Cuban food. So that's why I went there. We get there. We had a good time. We had a few places. We even took pictures. Come back to the car. How come I couldn't find a key? Looking everywhere for the key. And then I get into the parking ramp to see if I left it in the car. The car going. Bro, tell me why someone stole our rental car had to file a police report it was it was a big ordeal the next day didn't get any better because we still needed to get around the city so we had to get another rental car and that was a freaking headache oh my goodness so safe to say the trip didn't end up how I like it but uh I got a story to tell it's definitely memories one of the best memories, but it was memories. But uh, that's my update. I'm sorry I couldn't record everything for y'all because it was kind of hectic. But I am going to Chicago soon, so maybe I'll bring y'all for that one. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, I'm gonna end it right there. So I'll see y'all later. Peace.